everybody, and I'm back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I'm here with some Let's Play Dragon Age Inquisition. We have a lot of people we need to talk to in this episode. A lot of people have been a little bit neglected. We've already talked to Cassandra. Now let's go see if... Haven's best and brightest. Okay. Apparently I have things to do here. To field a decent Hi! It needs you are not Heron, therefore you are inferior. But I apparently need to still talk to you, so... Expected you be by. Hi! I'm Harrod. Um, Everyone knows dude, you. you are in my way. How do you get you? Fit? Um... Quite well. Sturdy and warm. It's perfect. Good. World's gone mad. Stock armor and blades are good against bandits, but we're not fighting bandits. My gear we're fighting demons and apostates and templars. So, <laughs> you need custom work, something special. Mm -hmm. You bring the materials to us, we'll make it happen. And now it's time to craft. Um, what can you make here? What can you and your team make here? Lots of things. You're not as we good as Hedon and Wade, though. Nobody is. Our designs are simple, but they get the job done. You want something fancy? Bring your own design. Let's <laughs> see what we can Bring do. your own design. Um. Uh, do you outfit the troops? Who outfits the Inquisition soldiers? The Inquisition? I've got work to do. Can't be passing a sword to every blighter who signs up. Sure you, you can. Want to help the troops, talk to Thren, the quartermaster. Okay. She'll set up requisitions. Requisitions. We need to do some of that. And why do you need my materials? Does the Inquisition not have supplies to make armor or weapons? Not really. Tough convincing traders to haul up here. Impossible <laughs> to get them to risk the rare stuff, so that's on you. Okay. Um, can you improve my equipment? Can you help improve my arms and armor? Yes. Arms and armor. You find a new piece, a pauldron or grease, okay. we'll take care of you. Okay. You can't just slap a new hilt on your sword in the field. Sure you can. Bring it here, we'll make sure it's done right and proper. I don't use a sword anyway, so... Um, do you have any designs? If I want something, what can you make? Start simple. Something to keep you safe. Okay. Take a look at it on the table there and we can talk. Okay. You'll need materials. We should have what you want just outside. Cool, bro. Goodbye. Goodbye. Right. Modify weapons. Modify armor. What's that? Craft weapons? Ooh. Is that craft armor? Craft armor! Sure, let's see what we got here. Apprentice coat? Is that better than what I've got? That's the problem. Schematic. I've got an apprentice's coat. You need something? Let me know. I think what I've got is better at the moment, so let's modify armor. Scout coat. <laughs> that helmet! That's what I look like with my helmet on, oh my god! I don't need to be wearing these things! You they are not. Something, let me know. Now let's go talk to the other people. Whee! The threat to me means go to the war room! I don't wanna go to the war room. Can I go this way? Lisette! Reason, Who are you? We cannot stay you're the one they're calling the Herald. Yep, that's me. Yes, I am. It rather rolls off the tongue, doesn't it? <laughs> no. Yes, it does. You are a mage, and magic was meant to serve man, not rule. I'm not. Yet it's not ruling me. Testing that core tenet of the Chantry. I did not join the Order to adjust my faith so easily, but I appreciate what the Inquisition is trying to do, and your role. Though you may find not many Templars do. Oh my god, she's a Templar. <laughs> Sorry, honey! Um... Tell me about the Templars. I'd like your take on the Templar Order. It's a shadow of what it was. Where once we both protected all people from the dangers of magic, we now posture and grab at power. One day, I hope the circles are again sanctuaries where mages can practice their craft. I don't think I've ever heard of them being sanctuaries. Are you staying here in Haven? You're not going to rejoin the Order. When the temple went up, your forces rescued those few of us still alive. My life is a debt I intend to repay, however I can. 
Yay! So let's not piss her off too badly. What happened to the conclave? Do you have any idea what caused the explosion? Me? No, I'm just a <laughs> Belief and faith doesn't get you closer to the important meetings. Though that distance did save my life. Yes, it did. Join How did you come to be a Templar? She's got a very right nice to chest plate for my somebody who's just a recruit. In Denarim. I could have become Denarim! a cobbler like my father, but this seemed better. It's a Templar to hold the or cobbler. And help Templar the mages through a troubled or time. Cobbler. <laughs> help us? I'm surprised to hear that. Not all Templars want to make mages into prisoners or villains. Some Sorry of us guys, just want to phone. keep a balance and let you practice your craft in safety. One okay. person trying to do something can make a difference. You should keep that in mind, however. Hawk and the Warden. Hawk and the oh, Warden. Okay. <laughs> Walk in the Maker's Grace. I'll try. Except I won't because I'm a Dalish and I don't believe in your cockamamie bullcrud. Is this where everybody else is? That looks like an exit. I guess I have to go inside the fort to get anything done. Maybe? Unless I just went the wrong way, it could be that too. Let's take the most roundabout way to get to places. Ooh, elf root. Why is there elf root here? Seems like a silly place for it. What's up here? Can I go up here? No, I wanna go there! Damn it. Okay, fine. Then let's actually do something with the storyline. Meh. Travel to Valrite. I don't want to go to Valrite. Meh. Damn. No, I want to go up here. How did I end up all the way up here anyway? Okay, what's in all the directions? Merchant, piece by piece. Solace. Do I go, gotta go this way or? I probably just need to go through the door. <laughs> Let's not make this any more complicated than it needs to be. There we go! <laughs> For some reason I was thinking that was the entrance to like the Chantry place or something. Merchant. Farrick! Farrick, come here! Farrick, come here! Have my babies, please! I want your babies. I want your babies. Farrick, where are you? Where'd you go? I want your babies! Give me your babies. Hi, Farrick! So, now that Cassandra's out Best of earshot, are you holding ever. up all right? I mean, you go from being the most wanted criminal in Thetis to joining the armies of the faithful. Yep. Most people would have spread that out over more than one day. I love usually like an open chest, even though it's snowing. Um, too many people died up there. I don't even want to think about how many lives were lost on that mountaintop. A lot of good men and women didn't make it out of there. <laughs> For days now, we've been staring at the breach, watching demons and maker knows what fall out of it. Why can't and we romance it? Why would be an why? understatement. Why? I still can't believe anyone was in there and lived. Um, why did you stay? If it was that bad, why did you stay? Cassandra said you were free to go. I like to think I'm as selfish and irresponsible as the next guy, <laughs> but this... Thousands of people died on that mountain. Yep. I was almost one of them. And now there's a hole in the sky. Even I can't walk away and just leave that to sort itself out. Good man. That was a good man. Um, I was fortunate. It's pure luck that I escaped. Good luck or bad? We haven't you figured that out yet. You might consider running at the first opportunity. I've written enough tragedies to recognize where this is going. Oh, no. Heroes are everywhere. I've He's seen worried that. about me. But the hole in the sky. That's beyond heroes. We're going to need a miracle. I'll be your miracle. I'll be I'll be your miracle. Don't I'll be your miracle, Eric. I'll be your miracle. Let me be your miracle. Talk to me. Is he gonna talk to me? I clicked on him. There we go. Um I have questions about Hawk. He's almost my size! We could totally date! Is he gonna answer me? Or is the game gonna I be read your there tale go. of the champion, and I have a few questions. That's a pretty common reaction. Go ahead. Um Where are Hawk's friends? Where are the rest of Hawk's associates now? Meryl decided to look after the elves left homeless by the fighting. Okay. She's done a pretty good job of keeping them away from the mages and templars so far. I guess she has plenty of practice. Oh, now we can figure out what happened to everyone. With her old Dalish clan. 
Fenris has kept himself busy hunting down the Devinter slavers who came south to prey on the refugees. But shouldn't he be with Hawk? Sure exactly Fenris Rome or er, Hawk romance Fenris. They follow the trail of corpses though. Isabella went back to the raiders. She's okay. called herself an admiral now. Okay. I don't know if she's actually in charge or just has a really big hat. It might be the same thing. She better have a really big Sebastian hat. And went back to Starkhaven. Okay. I'm sure he's boring all sorts of people there. Hawk's little brother was off on some warden business near the Anderfell's border last I knew. Okay. Aveline is still guard captain. I'm pretty sure. In Kirkwall. Would fall into the sea if she quit her job. <laughs> yes, that would. What about Hawk? I ain't done talking to you! Something. Um, questions about Hawk. I read your tale of the champion, and I have a few questions. That's a pretty common reaction. Go ahead. Um... What happened to Anders? What happened to the mage who destroyed the Kirkwall Chantry? I don't we know what I've done, but I can move. He fled this is Kirkwall weird. with the mages from the circle. Stayed with them a while. Even though he but blew he up the Chantry! Somehow a lot of mages blamed him for making them live as fugitives. I wonder I why. I don't know where he is now, and I don't want to know. Orsino's fate made no sense. In the book, you say that first enchanter Orsino turned himself into a giant monster made of corpses. How? Why? Do I look like an expert on magical weirdness to you? Yes. Well, I can't tell yes, you Yes, you do. But why, all I can say is he was desperate. You made up the Arashok fight? There's no way Hawk really could have killed the Arashok. It would have started a war with the Kunari. I was told later that the Kunari disavowed his actions. Apparently the Arashok didn't get permission before he attacked Kirkwall and the oh. in the March. When they finally sent a ship to haul the Red Dreadnought away, they just said, We will never speak of this again. <laughs> as far as I can tell, that's the Kuhn's Kuhn's version of an apology. apology. <laughs> Never mind. Carry on. Carry on. I ain't done with you yet. We still got to talk about stuff. Something. Um. Hi. I read your tale of the champion, and I have a few questions. That's a pretty common reaction. Go ahead. Date me. <laughs> no. Carry on. Why can't I romance you? Need something. Uh, personal question. Can I ask you something, Varric? Want to talk about me? I'm flattered. Also inclined toward extravagant lies. Of course he does. Um, how do you know Cassandra? How do you and Cassandra know each other? You heard about the Kirkwall Tantry being destroyed? Yes. The guy responsible used to be a friend of mine. The Seeker had questions about that. And I had answers. Uh, where are you from? Are you from Ferelden? Ole? Free marches. Born and raised in Kirkwall. Cool. And despite whatever it you It won't heard, even no, let me flirt bad. with him. What do you do? It won't even let me flirt I'm with Eric. Let me flirt with emerging? him if he won't let me I'm romance him. My family has a seat in the Dwarven Merchants Guild. Merchants buy and sell goods. Businessmen buy and sell stores. In my spare time, I manage a spy network, and occasionally, I write books. Occasionally, I write books. <laughs> Could you do Liliana's job? If you've run a spy network, why is Liliana our spy master? To be honest with you, she's just a better spy master. Huh? The truly great ones can keep their distance. They don't get attached to their people. Me, I always wind up babysitting my informants and worrying about their families. We're in better hands with her. Um... What books do you write? You're an author. What kind of books have you written? I tried my hands at a few genres. My crime serials are my most popular. Crime Guard serials? Down, guards breaking the rules to get things done. He has, he has a crime serial? It's the most famous thing I've written, or infamous maybe. He never mentioned that in two. I've a romance serial once, Swords really? and Shields, but to be honest, I don't have a knack for romances. Most of my stories... Well, uh, if we could... Probably that says something We could fix that, Varric, honey. We could. What shops do you own? What sort of shops do you own? Actually, we don't own shops. That was just an example. Mostly we invest in money lenders. Auction houses, a few mercenary companies, a couple of smithies. I think we own half a beet plantation in Ravane somewhere. Half a beet Most plantation? Of my brother's doing. Bartrand. Oh, Bartrand. <laughs> oh, Not much Bartrand. tact, but loads of business sense. Tell me about the crossbow. 
Where did you get that crossbow? I've Bianca. never seen one like it. Bianca, she's one of a kind. Funny story. He's crossbow I sexual. I ship and found her locked in a dragon bone reinforced chest in the hold. I broke three dozen lockpicks and blunted nine saws opening that drum, but it was worth it. Ha! Why Bianca? Wait for it. Who is she named for? I can't tell you. Oh! <laughs> I thought it's because Mirabelle's already taken. And the reason for that is? Complicated. It's the one story I'll never tell. We just but, have to leave it at that. But, but... Okay, if it turns out he's got a wife named Bianca Thanks, who sorry. died somewhere and that's why I can't romance him, I'm going to be very cross because I really want to romance Varric. Anything else? Need something. Um, tell me about Red Lyrium. The Red Lyrium we found at the temple seemed to upset you. My brother Bartrand and I sort of... He keeps going like this. Just an expedition sing, in the deep sing, roads. Sing, sing, we located sing, an ancient tide, so sing, old it barely looked dwarven. Sing, sing, I'm dancing fair. idol there sing, made of it. Sing, Bartrand brought it back to the surface, and, well, everything's gone downhill from there. What is it exactly? So what is it? Just another kind of lyrium. The red stuff is lyrium like a dragon is a lizard. It's not just a different color. It has a whole host of weirdness all its own. Then I've where did it come from? Cast house in Orzammar. No one's seen this stuff before or knows where it came from. Okay, what can it do? What makes it special? Regular lyrium can mess you up pretty badly, but you have to ingest it for that to happen. Red lyrium messes with your mind when you're just near the stuff. You hear Ooh, singing, bad. get violent, paranoid, and then it does creepy shit. Makes things float. Brings statues to <gasps> he life. He said a potty also word. Also turned Kirkwall's night commander to Lyrium. Everyone's been kept at least a hundred paces from it since. Okay. Why was it in the temple? How did the Red Lyrium get in the Temple of Sacred Ashes? I don't know. So as far as I knew, the only piece to make it to the surface was destroyed. And the location of the tiger it came from is a secret. Did someone find more of it in the deep room? The only people who would know that's would be the party thought. members who went on that expedition. <laughs> that's enough. I think that's enough on Red Lyrian. What if you let me flirt with him? Not really my flirt favorite Eric. subject. Ah! That's me banging on the desk. Probably overloaded the speaker doing that, but I don't care. I can't even flirt with him. What kind of bull crud is that? What's over here? Oh, cool. It's my requisition can I open it? Do I have to for some reason open it from the back or something? Let me open the chest! Jesus! Game, please. Let me open Fine. Who are you? You have a really nice turban. If you're here to clean, Hess can get you a bucket and a broom. Anyone calls you knife here, come to me. Oh, Anyone calls you knife here, come to me. Thryn, Inquisition Quartermaster. I'm doing what I can to supply this mess. Thank you! If you find what I need to fill one of my requisitions, I'd appreciate you bringing it in. I will. Um... Okay, so she's our requisition oh, personage. Make her go with you. Good to know. You have my hairstyle! You must die now. Darn it, I can't use my art magics. Um... This looks bad. Your this kind looks killed the most bad. holy. Oh no. Lies. Your kind Mages let versus her Templars die. in the middle. Shut oh, your fuck. mouth, mate. Enough. Thank you, Colin. Captain. That is not my title. We are not Templars any longer. We are all part of the Inquisition. Thank you, Colin. And what does that mean? Oh exactly? god damn it. Back Let's already, go Chancellor. Haven't oh you done enough? I'm curious, Commander, as to how your Inquisition and its Herald will restore order as you've promised. Of course you are. Back to your duties, of all of you. you are. I like Cullen. We're either gonna romance him or Sarah. I haven't decided yet. Ha! Um, actually, you guys have fun. I've got some more people I need to talk to. There's Lely. Varric, let me romance you, please. I want to romance Barrett. Where's Lily? Lily! Lily, hi! Blessed are the peacekeepers, the champions of the just. 
Let's and she's pretty. Sorry, honey. Nights in the shadow. In their blood, the Maker's will is written. Is that what you want from us? Blood. To die so that your will is done? Is death your only blessing? <laughs> you speak what fantastic, kind of no? Pray is that? What does the Maker's prophet have to say about all of this? <laughs> What's his game? Game? How is this a game? Do you see the sky? What about the temple ruins? The bones lying in the dust? Even if you didn't support the Divine's peace, you wouldn't call this right. No. Who could? So many innocent lives. The faithful murdered where the holiest of holies once stood. If the Maker willed this, what is it if not a game or a cruel joke? I can't speak for Andraste. I speak for no one but myself, and I have no answers for you. You probably don't even worship the Maker. Nope! <laughs> Lucky. He asks a lot. The Chantry teaches that the Maker abandoned us. She's so cheated! He demands repentance for our sins. He demands it all. Our lives, our deaths. Justinia gave him everything she had, and he let her die. You could blame her killers. Uh, maybe you should be angry at the people who murdered her. If the Maker doesn't intervene to save the best of his servants, what good is he? I used to believe I was chosen, just as some say you are. Her dream and origins. I thought I was fulfilling his purpose for me. Working with the Divine. Helping people. But now she's dead. It was all for nothing. Serving the Maker meant nothing. Let me help you. Maybe I like you, Leliana. I can help you I find can't it. I thought you were No, this Beric. is my burden. I regret that I even let you see me like this. It was a moment of weakness. It won't happen again. Let's make Come. it. Come. To work, then. We I ain't later. done with you, honey buns. I ain't done with your face. I, uh, hey! Let me... Fuck. I can't even talk to her! Oh, gosh darn it. Fine. So it's true. So what's true? What? I hope my hunch was wrong. You knew him well? Hunch? Not as well as I thought. Show me the Oh well, we still got Solus to talk to, I think. Is that Sol Yeah, there he is! Hi Solus! Solus! Wait a minute, what? Oh, there's stairs. Okay, good. Solus! Where's he at? Wait, what? It says I'm right on top of him, but he's but he's Is he through the door? No. Solus? Um. Honey? There he is! <laughs> he just. The chosen of Andraste. A blessed hero sent to save us all. Sounds dashing. Am I riding in on a shining steed? Slightly I approved. Have suggested Yay! A griffon, but sadly, they're extinct. Joke as you will, posturing is necessary. He's got a point there. I've journeyed deep into the fade in ancient ruins and battlefields to see the dreams of lost civilizations. I've watched as hosts of spirits clash to reenact the bloody past Where's in ancient his wars with famous from? and It's not forgotten. Orlais, it's not Antiva, it's not Ferelden, and it's not Orzammar. Every great war has its heroes. I'm just curious what kind you'll be. It's vaguely Scottish. You study ancient ruins? What do you mean, ruins and battlefields? Any building strong enough to withstand the rigors of time has a history. Every battlefield is steeped in death. Both attract spirits. They press against the veil, weakening the barrier between our worlds. Okay. When I dream in such places, I go deep into the fade. I can find memories no other living being has ever seen. How can you sleep there? You fall asleep in the middle of ancient ruins. Isn't that dangerous? I do set wards. <laughs> no, of and if course you leave food out for the giant spiders, they are usually content to live and let live. <laughs> That's impressive. I've never heard of anyone going so far into the Fade. That's extraordinary. Thank you. It's not a common field of study for obvious reasons. Not it's, so flashy wait a minute. as throwing fire the thing or on lightning. His... The thrill Is of finding remnants of a neck? thousand year old dream? Ugh. I would not trade it for anything. I will stay there. At least until the breach has been closed. Okay. Was that in doubt? 
I am an apostate mage surrounded by Chantry forces, and unlike you, I do not have a divine mark protecting me. He's got a point there. Cassandra has been accommodated. <coughs> do you understand my caution? Ah, uh, no, 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 we're not romancing Solas. Um, your fears don't matter, Cassandra will protect you. Cassandra trusts you. She won't let anyone put you into a circle against your will. Thank you. I appreciate it. I will support. protect my party members. But now let us hope either the mages or the Templars have the power to seal the breach. One of them will. Or both of them, or all of them, or something like that. Let's see, who else we gotta talk to? Apothecary. I go take a look at them, but we've got a Josephine to talk to, and a Colin. We should probably talk to Colin. Hi, Colin! Hi, Colin! Mages uh, and Templars okay, are already at war. Now they're blaming each other for the Divine's death. Which is why we require a proper authority to guide them back to order. Who? You. Who? You? Random clerics who weren't important enough to be at the Conclave. Ooh. The Rebel Inquisition and its so-called Herald of Andraste? I think not. Uh, proper authority failed. Why can't we work together? So far, you're the only one who's insisted we can't work together. Huh. We might. If your Inquisition would recognize the Chantra's authority. There is no authority until another divine is chosen. In due time. On I don't like this guy. Will be our guide, not some dazed wanderer on a mountainside. Uh. Uh, Colin, why is he here? <laughs> Remind me why you're allowing the Chancellor to stay. Clearly, your Templar knows where to draw the line. He's toothless. There's no point turning him into a martyr simply because he runs at the mouth. The <laughs> Chancellor's a good indicator of what to expect in Val Royo, however. He's got a point there. Okay. Is the Maid Templar Pen War large? Eh. Wait, what? The game just crashed! Be right back. Actually, you know what? That's actually a good time to end this video. My name is Miss Girl Tanager, and the next one. What the girl would you say?